Thursday afternoon, Fred settled in at the library to start his research project. Swiss Covery Unija is really cool. It's a tool that allows you to explore all of the library's available documents by using only one finger. When he thinks about how everything was done manually in the past, Fred realizes that it couldn't have been easy. It was while saying that that Fred realized he wasn't sure if he had brought the list of keywords he had prepared the day before. So, Fred thought, maybe it's in my bag. Fred searched his bag. Nothing. Fred researched his bag because sometimes he searches the same pocket twice but forgets another. Nothing. So Fred took drastic measures. Fred didn't find his list of keywords, but he found a packet of chocolate and praline-covered cookies that he had bought and had only eaten the topping. And an old piece of gum. Fred thought the gum was still good. Finally, Fred found his list of keywords and was able to do his research on Swiss Covery Unige. And for once, believe it or not, he was able to finish what he started. Yes, Fred, research tools have evolved. So have other things. It's important to know about them so you can use them correctly. For once, Fred had made the right choice. He had prepared his list of keywords and used the right tool. In fact, there are two main scenarios. In the first, you want to find a reference that you already have, perhaps from a bibliography or a scientific article. You have either the entire reference or just some elements, such as the author and date. In this case, use Swiss Covery Unige. It's the first tool to use because it will almost always allow you direct access to the full text, either electronically or by checking out the work in the library. In the second scenario, you do not have a precise reference, but you want to research a topic using a research question and keywords that you have prepared. For this, you also have multiple tools available. Swiss Covery Unige, using your keywords. Discipline-specific or multidisciplinary databases, full text access not guaranteed. For example, PubMed in Medicine and MLA in Humanities. Bah, j'étais là-dedans, puis tout s'est cassé la gueule. J'ai tout perdu, quoi. 